welcome back to Cooking with Events by Fly. This is Chef Reese. We have our guest here, um, Alto Competencia. Yes. <laughs> uh, we are on uh, cooking here on the 4th of July. Happy 4th of July. Um, here in Austin, Texas, we do celebrate with our sunflowers and our cowboy boots with the American flag on them. Uh, today we're going to be cooking a typical Hawaiian dish. Uh, it is a salted, ah! salted chocolate covered macadamia nut clusters. Uh, if you didn't know, macadamia nuts are actually not a nut. They are a seed. Una semilla. Let me see. No, I says, it's just una semilla. Uh, on the tree, they actually take uh, seven years to grow. They are originally from Australia. But they were brought over uh, to Hawaii as just kind of a crop to create shade for a farm. Um, and they just, you know, it's a long story, but they became extremely popular uh, in the 1950s as a nutritious snack. See? Okay. Wait. Almost an empathia. Okay. Uh, okay. Vamos. A poner los nueces. Okay, Macy. Vamos a poner los nueces. I apologize if I am a bit off today. I'm a bit tired. We had some neighbors uh, doing fireworks last night on the 3rd of July. <laughs> okay, bueno. Vamos a añadir los nueces de macadamia. Oh, if I forgot to mention. Uh, these were roasted in the oven. I did this already uh, to make the video a little bit shorter, uh, but I roasted them in the oven for 10 minutes on 250 degrees. I will be posting the recipe as I usually do on Instagram and uh, YouTube and our website. Okay, please see. Bueno, let's see the last one. Gracias. We're gonna be adding uh, two cups of macadamia nuts, roasted. These are raw and unsalted. later, which we're going to be putting on top, just sprinkle a little bit more on top of each one before we put them in the oven. Go ahead and combine this. So we have macadamia nuts, the coconut, uh, salt, and the stevia or sugar if you want to use that instead. Así estamos tu delantal. ¿Qué pasó? We always use aprons so we don't get a mess on our clothing. Okay, um, and next, you're probably asking where's the chocolate? <laughs> we are going to be melting two cups of chocolate chips in the microwave for about 15 seconds at a time um, until they just become a little bit gooey and you can stir them up and add them to the mixture. Moment. Reese was grabbing for the chocolate does like to have one at a time. <laughs> uh, so yes, we'll just go ahead and do this. Um, if you want to use a double broiler, you can, um, but a lot of people don't have one, such as myself. And so we're just going to use the microwave until they are a bit melted. We have our finished product here of the microwaved uh, chocolate chips. As you can see, they're a bit gooey. Uh, we're going to go ahead and use spoon here to combine uh, to combine the chocolate make sure it's all melted okay okay uh, eat Reese 
Vamos a combinar el chocolate con el tazón. ¿Ok? Muy bien. Y yo quiero probarlo. Vamos a probar cuando ellos están en el horno después del horno. Sí. Ok. Ok. Ok, viva. Vamos a añadir el chocolate. Combinar. Kaboom. So make sure you do use a microwavable bowl for the chocolate. Kaboom. Sure. No focus, Reese. Por favor, hace Reese está caliente. Está caliente. Here we see. Si quieres ver, está aquí viva. Get all that gooey yumminess out of here. Whew. Lots of chocolate. We are going to be serving these tonight. Um, yes, we are in the pandemic right now, uh, but we have a very big driveway and we live in a cul-de-sac. And we are lucky enough to be living in a neighborhood where fireworks are legal. So we're going to be having uh, some friends over tonight. Um, social distancing, wearing our masks if they need to come in and use the restroom in the house. Um, we will go ahead and share these with them. Go ahead and combine all this together. And yes, it is, it is gooey and sticky. But that's sticky. what makes things every. Mama, that's what makes things yummy, this is doesn't it? Sticky. It's pegajoso. Say. It's sticky. It's the pegajoso. It's sticky. Okay. <laughs> um. Duga. And we're going to be making a mini version of this today for you, since we are going to be sharing them. Um, you can make a regular muffin, regular muffin size tin. We're going to be using a mini muffin size tin. Uh, we've already pre-greased uh, the mini muffin tin, uh, so that is something that is in the recipe that you're going to have to do. This is sticky, Mama. This is pegajoso. It's sticky. Make sure you Don't get all of it combined. When it's sticky. Okay. Mama, don't eat it when it's sticky. No, comes cuando está pegajoso. No. No. Okay. No. No pegajosos. Ay, ay, ay. Oh, my arm is getting tired here. <laughs> Um, I will tell you these are delicious. Uh, I shared these once with a neighbor when we were still living in San Francisco, and he was sh pleasantly surprised that there were uh, there was no whey in these. Apparently, uh, usually there is whey in this recipe. Um, I said no, it's just these uh, simple ingredients that most of you actually have at home. Okay. Here is a mini muffin tin. If you haven't purchased one yet, I highly recommend it. Um, if you want just a little bit of yumminess and uh, you don't want to have the whole thing, uh, recommend using this. We see, momento, okay, baba, necesitamos usar el sal encima. Momento, okay? Okay, we'll go ahead and use one of our mini. Mini spoons right here. Best investment ever. Here we are. We're going to put it here. Okay. Thank you. I use it too. Moment. Thank you. Sticky. Mama, thank you. Moment. Whoops. 
Whoops, okay. too much. Cassie, Cassie. Yuck, yeah, though. So we're gonna pop these in the oven. Uh, actually, well, Mama. we will fill these, we will fill the tin, put a little bit of salt, just sprinkle a little bit of salt on each one, and pop them in the oven, and there you have it. You have an amazing snack. Uh, it's super easy, super yummy. If you are looking for yummy. something that you haven't, per that you haven't cooked yet for yummy. your pandemic party tonight yummy. for the 4th of July, highly recommend it. Yeah. Okay, Reese. Um, so, if you do have your children cooking with you, which I do recommend also, um, this is a messy project. <laughs> Reese, por favor. Gracias. Okay. So, we are going to uh, have to fill up this tin twice, but we'll put in this batch for you. And then once the video is done, we'll go ahead and put in the other batch. Uh, so we don't keep you too long today. Mm. <laughs> Chocolate, everyone's favorite. Huh? Okay, woo! There we go. Okay. Okay. Let's go ahead and put the salt topping on. I'm gonna wash my hand here. Chalk it all over me. Gracias, Papa. Okay, receipt. No, no, no. Usamos dedos. Usamos dedos. Okay. Okay, and I still have chocolate on me here. Okay, we're just gonna use a pinch. It already has a bit of salt in the recipe. This just adds a little more, and if you feel like it's not enough, a pinch, please go ahead and add more as you like. I love salted chocolate. Uh, one of my favorite chocolate bars is actually the salted chocolate bar by Hugh, a uh, human um, company that has a restaurant out of New York City. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and put this in the oven and I just need to double check how many minutes? Yes, only 10 minutes. Again, this is a very simple recipe, very quick and easy. Is that the timer? The chronometrico? And um, we'll go ahead and just wait 10 minutes. Um, you just want to make sure that they're hardened and cool uh, after when you take them out of the oven. And feel free to enjoy. All right, here we have it. Uh, 10 minutes later, uh, they are hardened. Uh, well, slightly hardened. Uh, we do need to let them cool to become completely hardened. As most of you know, chocolate, when um, it's hot, it's liquefied, and then when it's Sticky cold, mom. it's uh, Mama, solidified. I want to have this. A guante? Yes. See, si, Mama? Okay. Uh, so we'll go ahead and let them cool and harden, and then we'll remove them from the pan and go ahead and enjoy them tonight for our pandemic party for 4th of July. <laughs> Uh, if you don't have your red, white, and blue out, uh, go ahead and get one of these at HEV. Uh, we gave, uh, they have them, and they are fabulous. Thank you again for joining us, and I will see you next time. Have fun with this healthy, it is, believe it or not, it is actually a very healthy snack. Um, People tend to think that Mama, macadamia nuts are high in fat, and Mama, Mama. fat is good for you. Mama. <laughs> Ciao! Mama. Bye! Mama is so